Number 6. A CBS2 news reporter is talking about the Grammys when she starts to make no sense and says some really bizarre and strange things. Backstage coverage we're seeing for the very first time, Sari. Well, a very, very heavy, uh, heavy divertation tonight. We had a very Darrison bite. Let's go hit Tara Chazen those for the bit. She speaks professionally for a living and has never sounded this way before. Some people think it's a medical situation, which I agree with because if you look really closely, it kind of looks like one side of her face is drooping a bit, which can be a sign of a stroke. And if that's the case, I hope she got the medical help she needed. Well, a very, very heavy, uh, heavy divertation tonight. Number five. This, uh, oh, 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 what is that? That's because it's hot outside. Stuff like that happens. Did, was that live? Are we live? If something scary is ever caught on live TV flying around your face, here's a tip. Don't open your mouth wide enough to invite it inside. I don't know exactly what this creepy beach bug is, but I do know two seconds into the video is when he almost swallows it whole. The crazy bug turns around and takes a second go at him until he chases it off with his notes. Someone tell me what kind of insect this is and also why it seems so obsessed with diving into his mouth. Number 4. A TV news reporter is in the middle of a story when a man creeps up behind and it's all caught on tape. And it's likely one of those international cities might. No! Oh, I'm scared of this. Sh We're working here, man. How are you doing? Oh my God. Okay. I think it's pretty obvious that the man was joking around and trying to have a friendly laugh. He comes in with his hand on his hip, like her, but from her perspective, she probably just sees a stranger standing way too close and freaks out. All in all, he seems like a regular guy who just wanted to make a cameo on live TV and didn't mean to scare anybody. Number 3. Matt Rodewald is reporting on some crazy weather when he sees a person's car get stuck in a flash flood. They have to get away fast because lightning is striking all around. And just to further illustrate my point, this happens as they are swimming to safety. Think about how easily that bolt of lightning could have hit the water instead of across the street. Everyone who is getting away should consider themselves extra lucky they didn't get zapped. This could have been almost one of the most frightening moments ever caught on live TV. Number 2. A news reporter is assigned a story she really doesn't want to cover. Soon she finds she's covering herself with her hands out of fear. Bye. 